Good morning, Rye Sisters. Okay, so uh, true confession time. I have mentioned several times that I used to be afraid to send out emails to my email list, but I'm not talking about just a little bit afraid. I'm talking about crippling fear. Like I would not do it. This is how I first met Jen Smollett. So Jen Smollett is one of our Rise Sisters. She's a coach and I reached out to Jen and worked with her about a year and a half, two years ago to get over my block of sending out emails. Like I, I don't know if you guys can relate to this, but I would just have heart palpitations. I felt like I was bothering them. I felt like they were going to roll their eyes when they opened my email. I felt like I didn't have any value to deliver. I didn't even know exactly what to say. I didn't have a lot of products or services at the time. I have much more today and still feel like I don't have enough. That's, that's probably a coaching call for another day. <laughs> but I was just crippled with fear to send out my emails. And I worked with Jen to say, uh, you know, this is what I'm afraid of. This is why I'm afraid of it and really had to get myself in a place where I knew it was okay to send them, that people were on the other end waiting, and that if they unsubscribed, it's not the end of the world. And you know what? Today, I actually enjoy sending emails. So I send them out every Wednesday. I've got a, a, a format. It makes it so much easier because I know exactly what my emails are gonna include. There's gonna be a video. There's gonna be some kind of an article or a PDF. The text is going to be very, very short. And I enjoy sending those emails. So think about how you like to communicate. What would be easiest for you? And what's the cadence you want to put in place that you're going to be able to stay on top of? Um, it's magical when you kind of get that going and then you schedule in advance. So right now my emails are scheduled about eight weeks in advance. So when life happens, it's okay. Maybe I, you know, I don't schedule an email for two or three weeks. Well, I've got eight to 10 of them sitting in my schedule. So they're still going to go out and I'm still going to be consistent. If you struggle at all with hitting that send button on your email, know this, this is how we build our businesses. These people want to hear from you and you can do it in a way that's authentically you. Pick the mode of communication that works best for you, that's easiest for you to deliver and one that you can uh, you know, create an advanced schedule on so that you're not always running on the email treadmill, okay? I hope this helps, trust me. If you're struggling, I've been there with you and you can get to where I am today, which is I actually enjoy sending emails to my email list. All right, ladies, have a lovely day and I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.